what's up guys so we're only going to be doing four to five videos a month on youtube um of course we you just listen to the intro you're about to listen to the intro um there's no intro and there's no censorship of these words on rumble so including this video you're about to watch it's free to just go watch on rumble right now um i would just encourage you to just go do that go sign up either we do our live catches on there all of that stuff so go to rumble and of course you want to see all these videos early plus even more live streams and directly support what we do getting evil people like this arrested go join our locals to where you can see stuff um, months and months early and of course uncensored but yeah at least go to rumble uh, you shouldn't even be here right now but if you insist on being here enjoy the censored version of this video what's up guys before this video starts be sure to follow us on all platforms including on rumble which you can find in the pinned comment um, this platform has been giving a lot of people like us a lot of problems lately and <clears throat> rumble is a lot more receptive um, to free speech and whatnot so be sure to follow us on Rumble. Um, any video on here, you can also find on Rumble. And if you're looking for a video and can't find it on here, it'll be on our Rumble. So be sure to follow us on Rumble in the pinned comment. Like the video. What's up? Before we get into the messages with Emily, I need to go over this real quick. In all seriousness, I know that everybody's sick of the old commercial, so here's a new one. If you're interested in buying merch, which is very comfortable, in all seriousness, get the merch here. We have all new stuff, including sweatshirts, shorts, t-shirts, maybe even hats. Check it out. Pin comment, gordonflowers.com. This channel is a group of investigative journalists who make educational documentaries showcasing and educating society, especially parents and legal guardians, about potential scenarios that result from young people and adults conversating online if left unchecked. We conduct thorough interviews with consenting adults in an attempt to understand their perspective on why they partake in these conversations online with people that are not of age. The goal of the interviews in these videos and the videos themselves is to gain an understanding of the perspective of the individual being interviewed so parents and the rest of society can be educated and aware of potential thought processes and desires of adults online to unsupervised persons not of age. These videos are not to cyberbully, harass, degrade, accuse, or threaten any individuals partaking in the interview process or in the video itself. We do not condone any of these actions. These videos are strictly educational and we grant full permission for academia, which is any classroom setting or in scholarly papers to show or cite our videos. To ensure that these videos are strictly used for educational purposes, we strictly adhere to YouTube's community guidelines, such as not revealing someone's personally identifiable information. In other words, PII. YouTube defines personally identifiable information as their home address, email addresses, signing credentials, phone numbers, passport number, medical records, or bank account information. We thoroughly look at and edit our videos to ensure that none of this information about any individual is shown in our videos. To ensure extra privacy for each person that is a subject of an interview in any of our videos, as of September 1st, 2022, to thoroughly comply with YouTube's harassment and bullying policy, there will be no mention or information about the last name or first name of any person in in our videos. Due to potentially illegal activities discussed in our videos, law enforcement in the respective jurisdiction we conduct these interviews in is notified of each interview and video filmed by us. We are not accusing any individual interviewed of being guilty or committing a crime. That is the job of law enforcement. We are not vigilantes and we do not condone vigilantism or vigilante behavior, such as taking the law into your own hand or not notifying law enforcement when a suspected crime takes place. We are investigative journalists. Trigger warning. Some of what can be discussed in these videos can be sensitive to some, emotional, or stressful. The only goal of these videos is to educate the public. At the end of each video, as of September 1st, 2022, there will be an educational portion at the end to discuss what was talked about in the video and to discuss what people can take from that video and learn from and tell others about. Our goal here is to bring awareness and educate the public. Now the video will start. He's on the phone texting. Here, Pablo. Chat right here. I forgot to delete the stream on YouTube. That's okay. It's not like we uh, accuse anybody. Oh, that is that. That's, That's him. him. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. All right. She said she sees him. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> just, just remember, text her like... Text her, text her, are we, are we still going to do this stuff we talked about? Yeah, maybe keep the camera down for now for there. How many times can't run off? Find this picture. Yeah, no, 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 we, we see him, we see him, it's fine. Okay, good, good. Are we going to do the stuff we talked about? Yeah, yeah, just, I mean, I told her to say that, but just text yeah, her like, right. yeah, yeah. He looks white. Yeah, he's a Mexican. Oh. Well. Are you Tori? Huh? <laughs> Are you Tori? Yeah. Hey. <laughs> That's what Photoshop is for, bro. We're so, gonna do the stuff that we talked about. 
Huh? Are you gonna do the stuff we talked about at your house? All right, I'm about to hand you Sabrina. Okay. All right, all right. Okay. Look. <laughs> What's going on for her? Mm. You seem pretty pertinent about it. <laughs> you said she doesn't look like a picture. You said you live like what, a block away? Mm. Okay. <laughs> How long are you living? Hmm? How long are you living? What are they saying now? Huh? Whole life, man. How long are you living? Oh, he's just saying how long she's in town. Oh, he's nervous. God damn it, ask that question, Lacey. You seem nervous. Kinda. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Is this your first time doing this? Yeah. Oh, please, that one just kind of scrimmed get down. Shh. Oh, That's you, dude. <laughs> What's his first name? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Tori. I'll follow you. <laughs> oh, they're going to his house now. Let him follow you for a little bit. What do you say? Do you want to come over? Yeah, to follow me, huh? Hey, Tori, we gotta talk to you about what's going on, man. I knew it. How's it going? My name's Gordon. Sorry to meet you like this. Let's kind of head back to the part. I don't want nobody kind of hearing, okay? We're filming for everybody's safety. Um, you know, we brought cameras, so you can be sure we're not here to hurt you or anything like that, okay? Yeah. You're good. You're good, dude. I know. I know what happens. No worries, all right. Packers fan? Yeah. Okay. Here? How do you know? Facebook pic? Oh. <laughs> I'm not some. Brain Brainiac. <laughs> Aaron Rodgers is going to be to the Packers, what your wife's about to be to you, maybe. No, I'm just kidding, just kidding, but uh, just making a dark joke there. Um, okay, so obviously, well, we can kind of get away from, I'll, I'll be quiet. You obviously know we're here, right? Yeah. Okay. We're I'm getting... kind of figure this week, honestly, but I still can't go down. <laughs> gotcha. How old is she? Supposedly 13. Okay, that's what she told you. She doesn't listen, but yeah. Well, right, because obviously, you know, we're not, it's not the, that's not the person in the yeah. figure. Yeah, okay. So, I guess you're we're headed back to your house. Yeah. Okay. A lot to unpack here. So, it was, based on at least, it was Jared, you, and Melissa is all three, right? Yeah. Okay. So, you were those three accounts? Okay, gotcha, I figured. So, I guess the, uh, you made me kill a lot of trees here, <laughs> bring all this stuff out, it's all good. Um, so before we get into really anything, uh, how old was Kelsey as well? I honestly don't recall. Okay, well she's the other girl I was texting you, that's not here. Uh, how did you tell Jared she was? I honestly don't remember. Okay, was it around Haley's age? Probably. Okay, just too young to be talking to? Yeah. Okay, that's fair. So. When did this kind of stuff all start for you, man? Just like the other, her, honestly, first time ever. I don't know why either. Really? I mean, did y'all meet on like an app or was it on Facebook? Facebook. Okay. Did y'all talk on Telegram at all? No. I don't think so. I'm not. Yeah, I don't think so. Okay. So none of them hit you up on Telegram? No. That's kind of your own separate thing? Yeah. Okay. So, looking through all this, it seemed... I mean, you seem to be willing to be honest about everything. Yeah. Okay, sure. So, that picture Jared sent, that was your... No, that wasn't mine. That wasn't yours? No. That was just... I haven't sent any of mine. Okay, you just sent somebody else's? Yeah. Okay. So, she said she was 13, blah, 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 same kind of board. So, wh where, where did she find you? Where'd you find her? I honestly don't remember. I think it was... Some group, I think? A group, yeah. Okay, what group? I think it was a taboo group. A taboo group? Was it a taboo group or a teen group? Honestly, I think it was a taboo group. Okay. Because there's some other things on teen groups, too. Yeah. But okay. I, 
I may be part of one, but it's like there's nothing there, and I don't know how I got there. But okay. I'm not in any other teen groups. How did how did how did uh, your profile become get in, te in a teen group? Like how many how long ago was that? Somebody added me, and I don't know. It wasn't that long ago, maybe two or three weeks ago at the most. Okay. Was this like in it? Was this like a group DM type thing, or was it like a Facebook group? Like you know what I mean, like a group a Facebook message group. Facebook group. Yeah. Okay. How many how many members were in that group? I honestly don't remember. Was it a lot? I don't think so. I think it was pretty new. Pretty new. It was a new group. Yeah. Okay. You didn't make it yourself, did no, you? I okay. Didn't. Okay. So. God, man, I think social media is kind of consuming you, man. You got a wife and kids. Okay. So, you have Facebook, you have Instagram? I have it, but it's not, I don't use it. Like, I've had it for a couple of years, and I have like two followers, which are my cousins. Okay. And you have really use Twitter? I have a Twitter, yeah, but I don't, like I said, I don't really use that one. It's mainly Facebook. Okay, and Telegram, too? Telegram, no. I don't think I have Telegram. You don't think you have Telegram? No. Okay. I think you said earlier you kind of, kind of was your own separate thing on Telegram. Oh, no, not Telegram. No, I don't have Telegram. Okay. Sorry, I thought you were talking about Facebook. Okay, got it. So, it's not weird talking to an old man. No, I'm fine with being an old man, blah, blah, blah. So, it seemed like most of the sexual messages were on uh, basically the Jared account. Yeah. What was the reason for that? Honestly, I don't know. Did you kind of want to stay one step separated? Well, that and just boredom. Boredom? Pretty much, I honestly. Okay. And then, also, uh, who's who's Melissa? I mean, like, what? Who, whose picture is Melissa? I just don't know. Okay, and you. So you were posing as a girl online too. So it's like a Spider-Man meme, right? <laughs> <laughs> so, um, yeah, Haley says she was 13 here. So, I guess Melissa and both Jared were kind of just talking about you in order to try to get Haley to come to you. Is that kind of what it was? Okay, that's fair. So. So when Melissa's saying he's sexy and Haley says, hell yeah, she is, you okay, you play with him, I mess with him, does he have a nice Is she talking about you or Jared here? Jared. She's talking about Jared, okay. So then Jared's talking about you, so it's like a whole, it's like a whole pipeline to get to you, kind of <laughs> slick, give you credit. So Melissa here, as you, so you were controlling Melissa? Yeah. Okay. She asks, do you have nice And she says, I don't know, whatever, some symbol. She said, may, may I see? Was this meant to be like a picture? or in person here, when you said, may I see a picture? Okay. So, say she sends you that said picture, what were you planning on doing with it? Not seeing nothing. Not sharing it? No, I don't share anything. Okay, so the, you weren't, it was... Except for what I put, like, the stupid stuff I do. Yeah, no, it's, yeah, of yeah, course, no. who, who doesn't? Okay, so that was kind of just for yourself yeah. then. Okay, well, I, I respect that. Do you work at all? Not at the moment, I'm looking for work. What, what do you used to do for work? I haven't worked in a while, but I used to work at a jerky factory. A jerky factory? Yeah. Nice. So you went from jerky to jerky all day, pretty much. So, um, with Kelsey here, I mean, this we can kind of speed run through this one, because I think with Haley, it was a lot more messages. Um, with Kelsey, she told us she was 12. Okay. Said I had being 12. You remember that? Okay, yeah. cool. All right. I really appreciate your honesty so far. I didn't have really much interaction with Kelsey then. Yeah. Um, I mean, I really, really thank you, like... You know, I, I know it's not a good situation, but it takes a real man to. So, I mean, I just kind of saw your hand. It looked exactly like the hand right here. That is not me, I swear to God. It's not you? I have scars on my thumb and stuff, and that person doesn't. Yeah, let me see that hand. That is not me. It okay. does kind of look similar, I agree, but it's not me. Okay. So, this is, so... Why did you find this type of picture to send? Actually, somebody sent it to the Melissa page. Like, it was unsolicited, so I just sent that one. Okay. So, you chose the smallest to send them? <laughs> Why is that? I don't know. You're basically sending child. I mean, I know it's not, but it looks like it, yeah. Okay. So, here on Jared, he asked, do you have to no, send a pic? Not of your send me a sexy pic so by sexy pic i mean do you just kind of mean like nude or something no, like that? It doesn't have to nude, no. okay it's okay so god damn it so so weren't her full body it was just you just her this her, her like just her or whatever okay 
so let me come see you. Okay, what do you want to do? Hang out, wear your house, blah, blah, blah. So is, is everything okay with your wife at home? Not really. No, what's going on? It's not me passion or anything really. So does that kind of explain this? Yeah. Okay. So yeah, because I cause talking to you, I don't, I don't think you're a bad guy or anything like that. I just think you're lonely. This is, a pretty, yeah, this is my very first time ever doing this. Meeting him, okay. Meeting or even talking to anyone underage. Okay, okay. Except for family. Except for what? Family. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's fair. <laughs> so, I mean, obviously the messages were very sexual. I mean, were you planning on forcing any of this today? Oh, no. Okay. I even told her if we could just hang out. Okay. Would it have been her decision for any of this? Yeah, I told her it's your decision. Because okay. It's your decision. So, so, would have and all this stuff would have only happened if she's okay yeah. with it. Okay, well, I, I, I respect that. So, I'm not going to force anybody or anything, though. So your plan was all this, all this stuff, only if it's consensual, pretty much. Okay, I, I respect the hell out of that. Thank you. I'm not, yeah, not going to force anything on anybody. I even told her we can just hang out. Yeah, just, whatever she wants to do, yeah. right? Okay. So, how many kids do you have? Three. Three kids? Okay. So, who, who's this uh, Jared guy? Just some douche. Honestly, the picture is the dude that was trying to hook up with my wife a few years back. <laughs> you use his pics yeah. to do that? Did your wife cheat on you with him? No. Not no. Him, but I think she has cheated. So that kind of explains this. Yeah. Well, that's fair. So, oh my gosh. So, so is his real name even Jared? Is that, like, is that his actual name that she I used? honestly don't know. That's just the name. His name actually Jared? He said his name's Jared, yeah. And he tried to hook up with you? <laughs> yeah. They messaged and stuff. And I mean, was his name, what, was, what, what name was he used? Jared? So, was his Facebook profile named Jared? Yeah. Okay. And then I just made a secret one. W <laughs> with, it, with his name and everything? Yeah. Okay. So, that was uh, his... So, he actually lives here in Salem? No, he said he lived in Washington. Okay. Like, close to here? Wait, close to, close enough... Oh, okay. okay. Yeah, yeah. So, close, close enough to hook yeah. up, actually. Yeah. Okay. So, um... <laughs> wow. So, so, you, so, you're, so, you're Jared... From Subway, I mean from your your Yeah, yeah, okay. Got it. So is that kind of life I'm more bold than just being very sexual, calling this thirteen year old like a stuff like that? No. Well you you said it all on Jared. I know, I was stupid, I apologize. Okay. Did you like refer to this thirteen year old as like a I don't see that myself. Okay. Did you use some mean words to her? Probably. Okay. What was the point of that? Just to make Jared look like Just to make Jared look like a <laughs> yeah, I know, but I mean, you know, I, I mean, I, I get that, but it was also, you know, you, you telling her that in reference to her not texting you. I don't do that. I don't recall that. I mean, the whole point of Jared was oh, to get no, her okay. to, I mean, the whole point of Jared was to get her to come to you, right? Okay, so, I mean, you, I mean, so, so why, I mean, I get, yeah, you want to make him look like a sure, but I mean... Was there kind of, did you kind of feel more secure on that account, just saying all that stuff to her? Not really. I, like I said, I don't really know. Like, I'm not using a date or anything, so. I know. You're, yeah, you seem like a nice guy. But, I mean, it, it seems like, especially with your wife not being passionate, it seems to me there's some, like, internal frustration about women. I don't know. Well, I'm not here to judge you for it. I understand. I mean, that's like a, like, a lot of it was, like, raging at her. I mean, God, there's so much to print out, but... I mean, you, I mean, we, we both know what was said. I mean, it was like... <coughs> I give up miss talking to you, blah, blah, blah. So... Did I scare you off talking about an open marriage? Did you talk about an open marriage you and your wife are in? I mean, I talked about it on there, but I didn't really talk to it my wife about it. Okay, so that was fake? Yeah. Okay. Did you kind of use uh, open marriage to kind of justify this to Haley? That's probably like her part, yeah. Haley's part in this? Yeah. Okay. What time you thinking? Blah, blah, blah. We could be a thruple. Didn't mean to scare you off. So your wife doesn't know about any of this? No. Okay. What would you do if I fell in love <laughs> with you? And you won't, why do you say I won't? Because you won't, I might. So this has been going on for just a couple of weeks, right? Yeah. Okay. Like I, said, it's my very first time. I plan on completely and insanely. 
I, that, was, that was a line I seen on a TV show, so I thought I was just messing around. I know, but it seemed like you. It seemed like there's, in the you know, for both of you guys, an attachment kind of building up. I mean, probably because your wife was pushing you away and you know pushing it into someone else. I mean, it, I mean, were there? I mean, you mentioned not wanting to force anything, carrying. Or were there like, were there like kind of mutual feelings building up? I don't know, honestly. You don't know. You're just, we're gonna kind of see where things go. So was your plan just to make this kind of a one-day stand or just see if this could go long-term? Kind of just a one-time thing. One-time thing. So essentially, if she wanted to be like maybe just like play with each other, go. If she wanted that. I don't know if I would have done it. Okay. More like her decision? Yeah. Okay. Maybe they're the same person. I guess I should go block Melissa too. So, I mean, looking at... Look at your Facebook accounts, I mean. It's, it seemed like, look at your Facebook account, it seemed like the Jared's accounts have been around for at least since 2022. And Melissa's account been at least since 2022. I can't go back and look before that, mm -hmm. but it seemed early 2022. So what's- I did to try to catch my wife and never anything ever came out of that. Catch your wife cheating? I really didn't use it for a while. Okay. Until I got a notification. Yeah. So a lot of a lot of Jared's chats um, talking about very graphically, would you f Tori, would you f Tori, blah, 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 blah. I mean, and that was all of you probing to see if she would do that with you. Okay, okay. So, in the Melissa account, I mean, what was the point of making that account? Like I said, try to catch my wife. Just, try to catch your wife? Yeah. Well, so is your wife like bisexual? Supposedly. Supposedly, okay. <clears throat> yeah, I mean, this is a lot to unpack here. So, watching on my phone. So, how often do you watch? Honestly, not that often. Not that often, yeah. just though. Maybe once, twice a week. If once, twice a week? Okay, so. Weekly thing. Are right, looking for a boyfriend? Cause I'd, I'd like to get to know you. So, so if she was just, so if she was like just so open to Jared. Would you? When would you have broken it to her? I don't know if I would have. You don't know if you would have. I mean, was your plan to just make that an online thing then? No, I really didn't think anything would come out of it. Just see where it would go yeah. then. Okay. Do you smoke? Never tried. You ever? Uh, have you done anything sexual? Or you single, single, because you're kind of cute. You a good kisser. Would you kiss me? What did you mean? So, so you and, uh, you video called last Jared, but you didn't show your face. Okay. Uh, okay, so you promised all the sexual stuff would have only happened had she been okay with it. Okay, okay, so you, you wouldn't have used force. No. Okay, okay. So you're develop it yeah kind of puffy so I don't really have them okay so here would you probably kiss a 38 year old she says it does so that was referencing you here okay I appreciate how honest you've been man I, I can tell really yeah I heard. you said well now think about you all wet and naked from the shower I'll just grab my lube and thinking about you one more time. <laughs> When'd you get a I don't have My you, wife does, but I don't use <laughs> Okay, okay. I was kind of filling her out there trying to see if she'd disappear if I got too bad. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Honestly. But. So here you said, cool, do you like him? And this is in reference to you. Okay. Yeah, he's nice to me because he, he wants to bang you. LOL, JK, kinda. Okay. So you were both your wingman and <laughs> your guy. Okay, you can play all the rules here. I'll bet $10 he does, blah, 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 blah. <coughs> okay, so, so right here, you sent a message to your own account, Jared, here in September. What was that message? I honestly don't remember. You don't remember? Okay. Then you ask yourself, you, 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 as, you as Jared message yourself, hey, would you 
pay leave. And you say, honestly, I would love to. Unfortunately, I don't think she would give me the chance. That's pretty graphic. I mean, it's uh, okay. So this will going to be forced. No. Okay. No, no. Just her choice. Okay. So. How do you think you got that kid? Okay. So you kind of say, as Jared, Tori will act on it, blah, blah, blah. Okay. So. Man, I, I really, uh. So I'm sorry this is all happening to you, man. Um, it's really not fair what your wife's putting you through. But I would say, like, you know, obviously, uh, probably a soon-to-be divorce. Not not with this, but just in general. Soon-to-be yeah. divorce doesn't, doesn't help. Sorry, am I getting that? Uh, thank you. A soon-to-be divorce probably doesn't help, but... You know, it's, it's not hard to see your online activity. Um, not just this past year, for the past couple of years. I can only see Facebook accounts for the 2022, but I can't see, you know, but other things I can see. I mean, look, there's a reason why we wanted to do this when your wife wasn't around. Because if you didn't show up, we would've just gone to your house. You know what I mean? Like, he uh, live two blocks away, and plus I need a little exercise anyway. So, we, we, we can, we, we we can see kind of what's been up and you know obviously we don't want anybody around hearing this and there's a reason why it's here not nobody else you know none of us are here to judge you even her she's not here to judge you for anything okay but this has been going on longer than three weeks not with these two but it's online stuff yeah online stuff yeah i said but i said with underage and her it's only been that long but no the teen groups go back more than three weeks what teen groups i honestly don't know so you're in one teen group now, right? Yeah. Okay. So it's easy to see, like, yeah, okay, maybe Haley and Kelsey are the ones that respond to you, but the p amount of amount of people you've reached out to is a lot. I mean, you're aware of that, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Do you think you're reaching out? I mean, because if every if every one of those accounts reached out, hit you back, you'd probably be talking to over ten underage people. Probably, yeah. What's the youngest account you're reaching out to? Honestly, the youngest I've known is 16. 16? I've reached out to. Well, are these not a 12 and 13 year old? Well, yeah. Well, obviously those, but like prior to that. Prior to this stuff? Okay. But I'm talking about now, currently in this teen group. You're reaching out to pretty much I haven't reached out to anybody in that teen group. Okay. So you've reached out to other teens, though? Probably. Probably? Okay. Do you think that there's been people that are probably too young you've reached out to before? Okay, how many do you think over the years? I don't see that. Okay, it's over 10. You think it's probably over 10? Probably. Okay. So, like I said, I, I know this didn't start in 2022 or 2023, okay? And, like, I'm, I'm not here to judge you, but it's just, you know, you think my whole stack here is just messages to... F God. If it was just messages to Haley, I'd, it would probably be... You know, it's all out of order now, but it'd probably be like this. You know what I mean? It's a bunch of other shit too. Like, you know, I'm not saying you've had in-depth conversations with whoever, whatever, you know, Missy Jenkins, 13, from Mississippi or anything. But, like, you know, there's been other conversations here and there. When did that start for you? I honestly don't recall. You don't recall what? When it started. Okay. It's been in, I, I, think, your, I think your issue is you just have nobody to talk to about it. Probably. Okay. Have you think? Have you thought for a while, like, hey, I kind of, I'm kind of going down, getting sucked into a rabbit hole. I don't want to get sucked into. I never really thought anything. You just kind of did this, yeah. just kind of robotically. Pretty much. Okay. And your wife wouldn't really understand, would she? No. Okay. So, you know, <laughs> if you were going after like a three-year-old, <laughs> that'd be right, right, right. It's not the same thing. But, you know, I'm talking about teens, like, you know, 12 and up. Has that been a few years? No, honestly, it hasn't. Okay, when did that really start? I honestly don't recall, but, like, the, her and the Kelsey are the only ones I really recall talking to. They're that young. Okay. So there's a 16-year-old here and there? There was. Okay, where was she from? I really don't recall. Was she American? Yeah. Okay. Was it kind of just 40 messages back and forth? Yeah. Okay. Got it. So, did she probably, did she on her own free will send you pics you probably shouldn't have seen? I don't think she actually sent me pics. Okay. 
Selfies? Probably maybe selfies, yeah. Okay. Any any like provocative poses no, she yeah. sent? No. Okay. Did you hit her up on Jared also? No. No. That was just your uh, Tory account? Yeah. Okay. So what besides uh you know, because like I said, I can go to 2022. I can look at a all that type of stuff. You know, when did you try to catch your wife cheating with him? Because you said this was a few years ago you hit her up? Yeah. Okay, when did you try to catch your, your wife cheating with well, him? Well, with those accounts back in like 2021, I think. With Jared? Yeah. With okay. Jared. So Jared's been around for a while. Yeah. And you sent something to Jared in September of 2022. Yeah. Okay, so it's been used for other stuff besides that. What has it been used for? Just to mess around. Talk to other people, but or adults. Okay. But you kind of do it under a pseudonym or something? Okay. Oh, like a pseudonym? Okay. So, I, I mean, look, I'm not, you know, I'm not some expert, of course. And, you know, the reason I'm talking to you is because I don't think you're as bad as the guy in the ice cream truck around the elementary school. But I also know that... Um, like, I'm not new to the game where there's a girl account trying to get pics from somebody that happens to be a little bit too young. Again, you're not doing this to a 10-year-old, a 9-year-old. That's different. Okay, teens, yeah, I understand. I understand age of consent law, blah, 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 blah. Okay, I get it. Teens know how to talk. They can say yes. Okay, so we can forget the law for a second here. I know what those accounts are used for. Okay, I can prove to you, with, or we can just talk about it logically. That Jared and that Jared and Melissa were used for. Yeah, I understand to go talk to other people, but you, you don't think. You're, I mean, your wife's trying to cheat on you, but you're doing the same thing. I was actually thinking that recently. But yeah, I just think it's not working out with her, man. Yeah. Uh, are your kids like? Uh, do y'all fight in front of them? Sometimes. <laughs> we don't get... really fight, fight. We just argue. Okay, so it's not like physical. Yeah, and then we don't really get loud. Okay, do your kids like like you guys? Yeah. Cool. How old are your kids? 12, 11, and 9. How many sons you got? Three. Three, cool. Football at all or huh? sport, sports? They do, but they don't right now. You're going to get them back into it? My son wants to, but it's not time yet for basketball. Oh, yeah, 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 for sure. Yeah, it was best best thing ever is youth sports, man. My favorite time of my life. But um, you used to play football? No, I never played any sports. No. I just played football. Like recreationally. Okay. But you're a football fan, though. Yeah. How did you become a, Are you from here? I'm originally from Utah. How did you become a Packers fan? Utah doesn't have a football team, so I just went with the best one. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. True, true. So, um, yeah, that's, that's, that's fair. Okay. So, but yeah, I mean, going back to it, man. Look, you're not kidnapping anybody. You're not... I still don't think you're going to force anything today. Like, okay. right, right. So, like... I also know I'm not I'm not I'm not some you know cybersecurity expert, but I'm also I have common sense, and you know I can talk to someone man to man and you know just kind of not be stupid. Yeah. So, the Melissa account and the Jared account, I'm not saying you don't talk to adults, but logically and by activity logs, we know it's for other stuff that's probably you don't want to tell anybody about. It didn't start out that way. That wasn't the intention of it. Yeah. Okay, when did it turn into that? Maybe three or four months ago. Three or four months ago. Okay, so not three weeks ago, three or four months yeah. ago. Okay, so how many was this in, yeah, what was this, teen groups or what? Like I said, I, the only teen group I recall is that one that I don't like talk to. It's taboo groups and stuff like that. Okay. And is that kind of where the younger ladies under 18 found those accounts? Yeah. Okay, so how many is it really? How many what? Younger ladies under 18 kind of hit those accounts up. Recently, one, two, oh, yeah, I hit that one up, but not very many, I swear. Is it like around 10, you think? No, I don't think it's that much. Okay. Honestly. Okay. But you found them in the taboo groups? Yeah. Okay. <coughs> so did y'all talk about things that people can be considered taboo? Not with the, those ones. They, like, they never replied back for the most part. With those other teens? Yeah. Okay. What about the teens that did respond? Yeah, just like what they were into and stuff. Okay. Were they from Oregon too? Uh, we never got that far. Okay. And how, how old were they claiming to be? Or what were they? 
15, 14. 15, 14, okay. So what they were into is in sexual... That's yeah. fine. So, <laughs> the reason... Uh, yeah, I, I figured with I figured with Melissa, you're you're a little bit too smooth with it, which you know it's not a good thing, but it's also you know it's just, it's skilled, whatever, it's fine. Um, yeah, I figured you know if you're still asking for nudes from somebody, maybe you shouldn't be getting nudes from that. It's been successful before in that regard. Yeah, a, uh, in, I promise you. Okay, but you've asked other said teens for nudes. Probably a couple. I'm not okay, lie. so the third, the, I'm sorry, the 14 and 15 year olds. What were they talking about? They were into. Well, they, one posted about she went in her dad's room and touched him. So I was just curious about that. Like she never responded back to me or anything. And the other one, something to do with dogs. She talked to you about that. No, she didn't. She never. She didn't talk to me either. Immediately. At all. Okay, the ones that did talk to you, how did that go? Just pretty much friendly. Just like. Hi, what's up? Stuff like that. Okay. So they're posting this on Facebook? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. So are you sure you have not been on Telegram? I've been on Telegram, but I don't think I've talked to any, like, underage people. Okay. So what is I mostly tel I'm Telegram? Like, groups or whatever? No, I'm not in any groups on Telegram, I don't think. No? You don't yeah. think? Uh, well, you can get added to stuff and not realize it. But. Okay. Okay, have you been added to stuff without being asked to join? On Telegram, not that I'm aware of, but on Facebook, yes. Okay. What did you get added to on Facebook? That teen group I was telling you about. That, that teen group. Okay. Yeah. Any? Did you get any added to get it added to any DMs on uh, Facebook, like group DMs? I don't think so. You don't think so? So what's what kind of happens on? Do you have Wicker at all? No, I don't know what that is. Signal, no. Zangi. No. Okay. What kind of happens on Telegram? Telegram is like. I think it's bots, honestly. They just want to try to get money from me and stuff. Mm -hmm. Like, oh, do you have Telegram? Let's talk over there. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, so they you kind of go from Facebook to Telegram? Yeah, like, honestly, a few months ago, I didn't even know what Telegram was. Okay, so it's a new thing for you? Yeah. Okay. I mean, what you're telling me about trying to get nudes, um, you know, from people that are probably a little bit too young, and kind of about Telegram kind of know where this is going. I think we both kind of know where this is going. Um, you know, and then w what's important is you're not out taking... we got to put something on this. Yeah, that sounds like a safety hazard. Yeah, 13 year old with a lighter. <laughs> Alright, that's fine. Yeah, no. Whatever. Um, you know, whatever... Uh, pictures you see you don't take any of those photos yourself okay okay so you kind of know where this is going all right i think we all kind of know where this is going especially with telegram and facebook and all that secret chats all that type of crap what's up with that Honestly, I don't... you don't know as in you're not proud of it or no, I'm, of course i'm not proud of it okay Honestly. yeah because like i get I mean, not good in general, like, you know, yeah. I mean, we all struggled with it. I mean, we, we had addictions oh, yeah. ourselves, right? You, you've had addictions yourself as a 13-year-old, your ex-husband, okay. Yeah, so, I mean, we've, we've, all, we've, all, we've all struggled with it, man. Um, but, you know, obviously, it seems your case has turned into something that's kind of crossed the legal boundary. Yeah. yeah. Okay. And you know what I mean by crossing the legal boundary? Okay. I don't mean a 25-year-old tied up, right? Yeah. You know, you know what I'm talking about what I'm talking about here. You're talking about a little bit under 18. Yeah. Yeah, okay. When did that start for you? Recently. Like, okay. I've always been an older woman, honestly. Yeah, I got it's you. It's just a recent thing. This. And I don't really recall like when it exactly started. This child stuff. What? Child younger than 18. Yeah. Okay. What app did that start on for you? Facebook. It's all been Facebook. All been Facebook. Anything on Telegram? No. So Facebook is worse than Telegram, is what uh, you're saying. Apparently. <laughs> like I said, I think I've only been talking to bots from like men pretending to be women on Telegram. Yeah. Asking for money. Scumbag men pretending to be women. Piece, piece of <laughs> Dude, I, if I found out there was a men pretending to be women, I'd... I, I, dude, well, here, here, come on, let's see. Let's see. I, I, dude, I, I, I would freaking... I would freaking... So it would be, be like a... 
right yeah, now. Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. You know, I'm not actually going to hurt you, right? Yeah. Okay. All right. So, um, so this was on Facebook. Who's sending you this stuff on Facebook? Different people, honestly. Are these fellow kids or adults? Adults, adults sending this stuff. You're not taking any of these pictures, no. are you? Okay. So you're not you're not the one behind the camera. No. Okay. And this started a few months ago. Yeah. Are they sending this to Tori? Or are they sending this to Melissa or to, to Jared? Melissa. To Melissa. I figured it would be that because a lot of uh, traders pose as pose as that adult woman to get pictures from underage. Okay. So you don't want you don't want to be associated it's with that. Men that send it to her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah so don't want you don't want it. No. Okay. Because uh, so if you don't. There was this one that she says she's 15 that I did see the pic and I sent it to her to ask her if that was her because this guy was sending it to like a lot of people saying that's his daughter. Was it a naked so, pic? Yeah. And okay. I didn't show her face or anything, so you don't oh. even know if it's her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But she never replied or anything, so. So basically, oh, so you're kind of concerned citizen yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so you took this, so you thought this 15 year old's kind of being exploited in a way, and you took her naked pic and sent it to her, I hoping, it to her, hoping, yeah, hoping yeah, okay, 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 okay. So, um. So, so you're you're saying you get a lot of pics you don't want. Yeah. Okay, so you do want pics of thirteen year olds. I you, honestly don't. Well, hold on. You do. I know I've asked for them and stuff, but like, uh, yes. I like more developed. Like, and I'm not saying not underage. I know it doesn't sound right, but I know. Just, I, but right, right. But you did ask for pics of thirteen year olds. Yeah. Talking about. So, one way or another, you want those enough to ask, right? Yeah. But if you're gonna stuff you don't want how young are those going because because you can't just tell me oh i'm getting pics of 13 14 year olds but oh i don't want them yeah, of course i have a hundred pages showing you want them but you know there's a difference between developed and then just pure you know flat stanley you know flat as this table right here you know you don't want those pics seems like you're getting them not really seems well what pics are you getting that you don't want there's many the ones of people that don't know that i'm getting them what do you mean? Like there, some random person sent them to me. Okay. Because of the groups we're in. What were these pics? Just of girls. Okay. Topless. Topless. Okay. Was there any development at all? Yeah. Yeah. How old do you think they were? Probably. I honestly not a very good judge, but I'd say at least 13, 14. 13, 14. Okay. So, you know, I know, I know when it comes to a child. And I hate using that word, but you know, I, th I think we're both against it enough to be honest about it. Yeah. Um, when it rains, it pours. It never look. You that may be your limit, and I really believe it is. But you know, at this point, you should use your experience to kind of help us yeah. get the real bad guys. Because do I give up that you're caught? No, I really don't. It, what, what does it matter? You're not out to hurt anybody, you know. But the people sending those pics are, yeah. you know. So. What else are they sending you that's younger than that? And again, look, never in a million years am I going to accuse you of saying you asked for that. I honestly saying, don't think they've really sent me younger than that. Sent many younger than any. that? Any. Any? Yeah. Any? Okay. So, so you mentioned, okay, so do you also forward the other ones to kind of see where they're coming from too? No. No. How many times have you kind of forwarded one back to somebody? That was the first time. The first time. So what was the second time? That was the only time. I that was the only time. Yeah, okay. Got it. So, um, and these are currently. Did you check out that place in Portland's open? I am getting hungry. I'm sorry. Fried pickles, man. I love that. <laughs> What's your favorite food? Cheese curds? Packers fan? No, not no. Cheese curds. Oh, okay. You're a fake. <laughs> <laughs> You're a fake in more than just posing as a girl online. So, um, I see. Okay. So, how often are they sending they sending these to you, man? I'm sorry you have to get these. Not that often, honestly. Like, is it a weekly thing too? No. Like, once every so often, every so few weeks, maybe. Okay. So maybe it's twice enough, twice like a month. One guy that I told you, I reported to that girl. I blocked that guy. Mm -hmm. Is twice enough fair to say, or twice a month? Probably. Okay. I, 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 how many are they sending at once? Like, cause I know. It's I, like usually one. Usually one. Yeah. Okay, but you said it was a bunch of topless girls naked. So how many pictures was that in that spurt? Probably at least a dozen. Okay, so one dozen. Okay. So how many of these were videos? How many of these were pictures? All pictures. All pictures, okay. How many times have they... And you're not asking for any of this? No. Okay, that's fair. So 
since you're not asking, now just tell me what they're all sending then, because you know we can be on the same page with this. What, how many videos have they sent of this stuff? None of that, I swear. None of that? Yeah. Okay. Any pictures of them in, uh, with an adult? No. No? Just them kind of posing? It's like that, and then it looks like the, uh, there's a couple with a couple, like two teen girls. Two teen girls? Where you can't see anything, but you can tell. What are they doing to each other? They're like kind of hugging each other with no okay. shirt on. Okay. So are, are the poses they're doing kind of provocative and the other ones like just, well, yeah. okay, all right. So it's kind of meant to arouse in a way. Yeah. All right. So, um, gosh, okay. So these are, so you're not sharing these at all? No. Okay. So do you have some secret chat on your, secret folder on your phone for this or is this like in your gallery? Or? It's just on Facebook. On Facebook. Yeah, there's nothing in my Okay. Okay. Yeah. Have you ever deleted some of these off your gallery? My gallery? Huh? Or Facebook? No, 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 I mean like have have you ever deleted some of these CP images off of your gallery? I don't think so. No. Ever saved any? No. Okay, so they're just all sent to is it the Melissa Facebook? Yeah. Okay, any sent to Tori or to Jared? No. Jared's too much of a to uh he's too much of a to, to for the people who can send it to him. Okay. You know like it's a so, so, what prompted you to use Melissa to, sh to start kind of for that stuff? I honestly don't have a reason or anything. It just happened. Just happened. Okay. I mean, do you think maybe because younger is kind of more understanding in a way, or I don't know? It seems like this is all kind of marital problems. And I mean, you don't want to let your kids down, dude. No, they seem to love you. I mean, I think first what can help you is getting a job. Yeah, like I said, I was out looking, putting in applications. You got why'd you got why'd you get fired from the jerky factory? Well, I didn't work. I didn't get fired. I got laid off because it was a seasonal thing, and I've been pretty much a stay-at-home dad for several years, and that's one reason it's kind of hard to get a job right now because people want people with more recent experience and stuff. So. So seasonal thing. So how many years ago did you get laid off? Honestly, it's 16. In 2016? No, 16 years ago. 16 years ago? I've been a stay-at-home dad since 2011. I did odd jobs here and there between 2007 and 2011. Like nothing permanent and nothing. So your wife's like a teacher at a startup or something? Yeah. So... So basically... It's a seasonal thing, but how many, I think 48 seasons have passed, if it's, uh, so you got laid off in 20, 2006? Seven. 2007. So, so 16 times four, so 64 seasons have passed. I think it's more than a seasonal thing. Well, no, the, the job was seasonal. Like, they had permanent workers, but only so many would work through the summer and stuff, and then once fall came, you'd get laid off until next summer. All right, but it's been next summer. Well, no, I know. Sixteen times. Yeah. Just, okay. All right. How did I was that long ago? Was it like the Jack Link's beef jerky? What kind of beef jerky? It was a Werner Meats. It's in Tillamook. Oh, so you lived here and went drove to Tillamook, or you no, changed? No, I lived in Tillamook at the time that I worked there. Why'd you move here? Tillamook's so much nicer. Well, I moved from Tillamook back to Utah, and then I came up to Vancouver, and then I met my wife. Oh. And then we, my mom used, my grandma used to live in Alto, my mom used to live in Albany. And we ended up down there, and then we ended up in a shelter in Mount Angel, and then we ended up here. Okay, so, oh, because your oldest kid's 12, so you've been a stay-at-home dad since 2011, okay. Well, I, I mean, that's uh, different. So, so, I mean, do you think your wife being the breadwinner is kind of the reason why marital problems are happening? Because I've noticed, like... I've noticed, like, we had a te we had Mr. Harris in high school. He, we had a teacher who, he, he said verbatim, my wife makes more money than me, and I'm okay with that. Divorced very soon after. I honestly don't think, feel like it's that. You don't think it's that? No. Okay. Because, like, the guy's supposed to lead and be the breadwinner. Yeah. You know what I mean? So it's kind of reverse. So, like, yeah. when a woman has to act as the man, she's going to think of her man as not a man. You know what I mean? It's yeah, just yeah. kind of, it's, it's psychology, man. It's psychology. But, it, it, you know, of course, that's misogynistic and terrible to say nowadays. <laughs> yeah. But whatever. That's a whole other conversation, right? So, I mean, how long has y'all's marriage kind of been on the rocks? Honestly, like, on the rocks, only probably about a year or two. A year or two? Yeah, we did have a little bit of, and it wasn't really marital problems, but a few years ago, but 
Yeah. Okay. So where do you go? I don't even know. Whatever. Okay. So if, if he, so is she she's been kind of a startup teacher for she's been teaching for however well, she's long. She's an assistant, but yeah, for a couple of years. Okay. She's going to school to be a teacher. Y'all rent or buy here? Rent. Okay. Yeah. So I mean, she's been out of the house for so long. I I know this online. I mean. I can't even see back that long. You just got to be honest with me at this point, dog. Yeah. And, you know, I, I support all men kind of bettering themselves, doing stuff like that. You just got to be honest with me at this point, dog. Like, if she's been out of the house for this long, five days a week, whatever, I know summers, whatever, blah, blah, blah. She's been out of the house this long. I know the online other, not with underage, but the online other has been for at least a decade then. Not that long, honestly. Okay, but it's been more than half a decade, probably seven years, eight years. I don't think so. Okay. Before 2020? Before COVID? I don't know. You don't know? Yeah. Okay. Has it been too long to remember? It's been... I, I don't remember a lot of stuff from weeks ago, honestly, so yeah. But it hasn't been more than five years. It's probably been less than five. Okay. Was it when Trump was still president? Probably. Okay. So it's been before, maybe during COVID. Yeah. Okay. So... Did this involve, uh, what, so what, what prompted you to get online and kind of just start, uh, you know, messaging the world? Boredom. Boredom? Being alone all the time. Being alone all the time. Okay. What did that place in Portland say? I just door dash in, uh, they're sending a driver to uh, deliver the food. Dude, it's going to be a while from Portland. Portland actually's? Yeah. Better have used your hard for that. I <laughs> I'm not paying you back. <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> okay. So. How much would you tip for a drink like that? Uh, I just did $10. You're a That's cheap. Right? You're a cheap. No, I have money on my wallet to give them when they come here. <laughs> you know? Oh, well, like you haven't done it. Yeah, f you. No. <laughs> <laughs> what a piece of <laughs> you, I mean, you would tip more than $10. Yeah. You know who's Jewish, Especially right? Especially from Portland. I don't. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you're not a skinhead, are you? No. What? <laughs> I'm not, honestly. Yeah. Well, you don't Trujillo. support skinheads? <laughs> what? You don't support skinheads? No. What? Well, I mean, without your glasses, you're a Nazi. I mean, I'm sorry, I can't see. I can't see. I can't see. Excuse me. Sorry. I almost... Um, okay. So, look, man. I mean, like, th there had to be some type of curiosity about, you know, I know the other... But about the taboo stuff with like younger ladies under eighteen, I, it's, I think it's longer than even a couple of months. It, I swear to God, it's not. Like, it's, it's, I was, I don't know how I got in the taboo group, but like, I started just out of boredom because like, early on, me and my wife were gonna try to be polyamorous and stuff, so we joined some groups, and I was just kind of interested in it. Uh huh. And that's it. Just went from there. Okay, so it kind of veered off into underage stuff. Yeah. Okay. <coughs> so what about? I mean, obviously now you're in a, obviously now you're in a point where at least you've, I mean, based on just the numbers you're telling me, you've probably received over 20 child images. So what, so what about this underage stuff is in, ex, exciting enough for you to just be here right now? I honestly don't know. I, I mean, like, yeah. you're going to say, I mean, what, what you're doing right now is you, you you do know, but you think we're gonna judge you for it, which we're not. No, honestly, I don't like. I like said like, just being lonely and stuff. I guess. Like I like I said, I just gonna hang out with her. I told her we can hang out. And that's all we have to do. No, I mean I I know I know you were gonna leave all that stuff up to her. But I'm not, I'm I'm just saying like, this could have been with an adult. This could have like <laughs> the online stuff could have been with an adult. But now you're I mean, you understand now you're at a point where. You know, it, you're at a point where you're using a fake woman to go get child pics. I mean, do, do you not see how deep of a rabbit hole that is? I do. But, I mean, is, is there any, besides what's on the Facebook chats, is there any pictures that you think we should get rid of right now on your phone? Honestly, no. No? Okay. Because I want to give you that chance. Yeah, yeah, yeah. On, my, on my phone, it's just my wife. Okay. Okay. So there's no like, no. so every, every, everything that 
someone could say like, oh, this is illegal, would be on your Facebook chats. Yeah. Okay. All right. Got it. And that's only, is that only on Melissa? Yes. Okay, sure. It's not on Jared. Yeah, I'm pretty sure like everyone blows Jared off pretty much. Everyone blows Jared <laughs> off. Well, you said in that small little, <laughs> I think they, I don't think they'd blow him at all. <laughs> but, um, dude, okay. Are you sure that was not your? I'm 100% sure that's not mine. Okay. Okay. Because the same color pubic. We saw the inside of the house. That's not my house. Like, there's. Yeah. I've never had mattress like that. Never had covers like that. Okay. Like, right now, I have a Green Bay Packers cover. <laughs> okay. All right. Take your word for it. I mean, you know, still sending a picture. Yeah. It doesn't matter if it's yours or someone else's I to know. to a minor. That can. Uh, I'm not going to say that can you in the ass, but that doing that can you know what i mean right so basically just uh yeah i mean are do i mean are you planning on telling your wife about this i mean i can't make you well, I mean, what do you what do you think she would say she'd freak out she'd freak out yeah <coughs> what if she's doing this too i don't think she is but yeah probably with, probably with people like jared so I mean, yeah, I think I, I think you just need a lot more. Um, you need to be a little bit more productive in life, yeah. man. I mean, I, I I respect the stay-at-home dad. Um, can't call it a hustle, but you know, I respect the stay. I, I respect a parent being being there for their kids, yeah. but I mean, you know, I'm not saying 12 is some adult, but they're getting to the point where they can just go to the park and you know you can yeah, just yeah, go like, work yeah more for a job now. yeah put them in you know <laughs> throw some shoulder pads on them you know make them go hit somebody or something but uh, jesus christ but you understand like these pictures that you see and i mean if it's really 13 14 that's the limit even then man that's your son pretty much that's your son you wouldn't want somebody doing that you wouldn't want somebody doing that it's, it's not good. It's not good at all. And then Jared, so imagine if her dad, Haley's dad or whatever, um, imagine if she th he thought it was Jared doing all of this, and he goes to Jared and shoots him in the face. Because that's his real name, isn't it? Like I said, it could be. Like I've never met the guy, so who knows if he was even... But the spelling, the, yeah, but this yeah, the same, it's the same spelling and everything that he used. So as far as I know, yes, it's his real name. Okay. Yeah, because you see it was like Gerard. It's like he was some basketball player for like the Brooklyn Nets or something, but... Yeah, man, it, it's, it's... Like, you, like, you, like, it's just... I mean, you're at a point now just on your phone. I mean, do you have a computer you do this on too? Uh, phone. Just on your phone. The thing you're getting yourself into child meeting minors for not forceful you to get the idea an online impersonation of all these people is was that Melissa's real name too? No, no, some random. Like I said, I found, I found it on the internet, not even on Facebook. Okay, okay. So I mean, all of this stuff, man. I mean, that's really. Yeah, this is. I'm done with this. Yeah. I'm deleting all of this. I mean, at least I wasn't. As well, that's basically like as big as. Yeah, right. You know what's funny? We caught someone a few years ago who also imper imper <laughs> freaking is they look the exact same. It's so funny. You look exactly like this other guy we caught a few years ago. Um, he was impersonating. It was worse though than what you were doing. He was impersonating his cousin. Uh, he was impersonating his cousin and sending her nudes to us. And you know, to verify, I asked for more um, just to make sure it was really you know to see if it was her or not. At all angles too, you know. <laughs> Do you guys call the um, oh, Karen. I got you. I'll vouch for you, dude. Yeah, I'll vouch for you, dude. Hey, I'm walking as fast as you did. How's it, how's it going? Good, are you? Hi, good. Most kind of the Nelson Police Department. 
Hi. Hi. Uh, we're just having a conversation here about some stuff. I mean, this is going to be the last time you try to meet a 13-year-old, right? Yeah. It's not going to happen again? Yeah. Okay. And he did say there was some child on his face, but we were going to delete all that child. It's already been deleted. Like, I had a hunch about this one before I came. Oh, you deleted the child? I deleted, yeah. Oh, well, he told me it's still on there, so. Okay. Yeah. Are you the one to call it? Yeah, that was me, sir. Yeah, yeah just. You over here for a second? Yeah. Just let, yeah, let y'all know we're also recording. Yes. Oh, yeah. Okay. I'm Chief Flowers, at the Onsville Police Department. Uh, he's going to be handling the investigation. Of the event, so. Yeah. I'm just going to hang out and be here for you guys if you need anything. And Absolutely. Yeah, it was just a situation. He just tried to meet who he thought was a 13-year-old girl, and he said he wasn't going to, I mean, you were gonna, he wasn't going to force anything. It was just going to be consensual, he said, um, with that 13-year-old girl. And he also mentioned there was child on his phone, um, on his Facebook account, but he, he's, he also claims he's going to get rid of it, too. So um, do what you will with that. Right. Did you have any ID on you that I can I get? don't. You don't have any ID? His name is Tori. How do you spell your last name? And your first name? Corey, P O R Y. Do the middle. And date of birth? Phone number for you? Officer, talk with you. When we're done here. Is this some of the yes? Yes. So basically, your copies. No, keep them. Keep them. But we can send them all to you digitally in order. So. He was um, himself online, and he also posed as a into a real person named Jared, who I guess lives in Salem. But he was talking sexual under Jared's name, like he made a profile with his face with his name, so like literally impersonating him to talk sexual to who he thought was this kid. And um, he also sent a, uh, I think he sent, I think he sent multiple pictures to Haley, or was it just one? Okay, he just sent one to her. So, um, to he was a 13 year old. Um, and uh, yeah, and he also used this account named uh, Melissa in order to try to solicit pics from us too. I mean, obviously, we wouldn't provide him with what he was asking for, but like, he said that he's using Melissa before to get other, like, to get child sent to that account as well. And uh, so it'd be sitting on that account, whatever he has right now. Okay. But yeah, these are all out of order, but like, everything on the left is him, or everything on the right, so. Um, it's like, yeah. Have dates or times or anything like that so we can put them in order? If we need, is that what this is here? I can, like, send you all in order in, like, two seconds uh, via yeah, the phone. Yeah, we'll get a business card from yeah. the officer and you can send them all to his email. All right, yeah, that'll that work. That yeah. But, I mean, if those are our copies, we can take those too. Yes. Size. Uh huh. And then she was a, uh, she was she playing it not online, but she was playing as a 13 year old in person because she looks similar enough, at least from a distance. And uh, we have him on camera leaving here and starting to walk towards his house. Mm -hmm. So. Okay. You mean after the initial? Mm hmm. Getting his information. He's on the call. Yeah. And this is what organization? We've been like all around Oregon doing this. Like we're from Houston, Texas, but uh, we frequent Oregon pretty often. Have seems to be good luck. Do you 
mind giving me your information? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll give it to you. Okay. What's the last one? Shoulders like me, you experience any pain anywhere? No. Okay. We'll just don't walk those so they don't tighten up on you when you sit down, okay? Absolutely. Here, let's just show him real quick. Uh, so, he, okay, apparently he did send two. Clearly not his. Um, so he sent this on the Melissa account. Uh, so he thought it was his kid. I mean, obviously that's not him. But um, then he sent another one that was a very small picture that I think is his. <coughs> it looked like his hand to You already know. Yeah, do you care about the kids or the content? Right, let's go clout chasing. Oh, you're right, you're right. <laughs> you're right. 